Hey, thanks again for tuning in to Leroy Scott TV. Listen, I want to talk to you about the big day, the proposal, not necessarily the wedding day, but the proposal, because the proposal can be more anxiety provoking than the actual wedding day. I had a young lady come, came into my office and said, I'm totally anxious about this guy proposing to me. I am totally nervous. Why? Because I don't necessarily know if I want to spend the rest of my life with this guy. I mean, I love him. I enjoy being with him, but I'm not necessarily sure that I want to spend the rest of my life. So she was totally anxious, totally frantic. And this was the other element of it. Did not want to break the guy's heart. Now, think about this for a second. You are in a position, in a situation where you're getting ready to get married. And anybody that's ever been there, you can't tell me that it doesn't produce a tremendous amount of anxiety. Several things go through your mind. You know, will I be able to be faithful? You know, is this the person I want to be with for the rest of my life? Um, will I be able to support this person? And will I, will I be able to support the family? How do I leave my family? How do I leave my, my friends? How do I transition from being single to being married? There's a ton of emotions that come along in your life whenever God is moving you towards a covenant relationship. But I want to tell you a secret. It's very, very normal. Don't worry about it. Relax. All that really matters is, if, is, is that you really care about and you really love this person. And I want to tell you something, that if you do, guess what? You can even say to the person, listen, I love you, but I'm not ready yet. One of the things you've got to understand about love and about relationships is that if you say no at the proposal, you've got to understand that no doesn't mean never. So you, you and your partner really have to take it at your own pace. I've seen so many relationships fall apart because of the expectations of other people, but not for you, not this time. If you're ready, go ahead and do it. If you're not, simply talk about it and let it be your own conversation between the two of you. Listen, I want the best for you. I believe that God is gonna bless your relationship, bless your marriage, and you're going to have one of the greatest marriages on the face of this earth. But it's all going to happen in time. But not only in time, it's all, all going to happen truthfully. So be honest with your own heart. Be honest with your partner. And make sure that when you say you do, make sure that you truly mean you do. Don't ever say you do if you really don't. Thank you for tuning in to Leroy Scott TV. I want you to go to my website and I want you to go to the blog on my website. There's some really, really great articles concerning anxiety, concerning relationships, concerning your proposal, um, concerning what comes um, after your single life and once you get into your married life. You're going to love the information on the website. And I want you to stay connected to me. Thank you for following me. And we'll see you next time at Leroy Scott TV.